Good morning. Welcome to Sunset Studios. Today we are going to make this adorable looking dog. As you can see, I've done it on two different shaped rocks and now I'm using a slightly different shape, but a, about the same. Again, it's an oval held the long way. I've painted the rock white and I'm going to show you how I drew on the very simple design. Take your pencil and you basically just make a line going on one side, a line curves a little bit going on the other for the ears, okay? And then you wanna make your nose, which is at the bottom, popping up, and then your eyes, which are not as big as on some other designs that we've done, the regular shaped oval eyes, and that's it. And now we're gonna get our paint ready. Okay, our first step is to paint the ears, the nice dark brown that I've chosen. If you wanna reverse the colors in any way on this, you could, of course. You can do what you like. All right, this brush actually feels a little bit too thin, so I'm gonna to switch to my um, slightly thicker brush. There we go, that's better. And make sure when if you have a little bit of a thicker rock, like I do here, you really do get the sides because that looks good. Just makes it look a little more finished. Okay, that's one side. Now we're gonna get the other. Okay, there are the ears. Now I'm gonna clean my brushes and I'm gonna go with the um, tan color. And I think I will go back to a thin brush. And I'm going to do the tan. Let's see, I'm gonna leave room for white and I'm actually gonna go right over the eyes. So you're probably like, why did you bother doing the eyes? Well, I like to know basically where they're gonna go. It helps me remember. But that's up to you. You kind of get your own way of painting and everybody has a different trick that works for them. So if you figure something out and you want to share it in the comments, would love to hear from you. Okay. All right, now if I feel like I've done too much of the beige, I can always let it dry and go back with my white and go over it, okay? Because what I'm trying to do is just really get sort of that amount. Okay, now I'm just gonna get my black paint and get his nose, which is a, just a half circle at the bottom of your rock. Easy, easy. A little more paint. Okay, now I'm going to dry it and add another coat. Okay, so my dog is dried and I've added second coats. He's ready to go. And I've actually drawn the eyes. They're probably a little hard to see because I don't want to go too hard with my pencil. Sometimes after you put several coats of paint on, 
you've just got to go really gentle with your pencil otherwise you tend to um, take some of the paint off okay but as you can see I made ovals with halfway through I made a line okay because the top part of the eye is going to be a dark brown just like the ears and the bottom part is going to have some white and some of the beige showing so I'm going to just get the top part of the eyes done okay just like that and now I need the tiniest amount of white for the bottom of the eye get a little off my brush okay so it's just like almost like a, a sideways C amount of white just a little curl of white okay and now I am going to take my pencil point and dip it into my white that might be too much so I'm gonna just make one dot okay and now what I'm gonna do oh no <laughs> that's okay he's okay is I'm going to put a dot of white on the lid or on the top part of the eye I should say okay now I know that looks kind of funny but it will come together because my next step is to take my paint pen and I'm going to go around the shape of the eye and I'm going to make that line across and that. Okay, that's one done. Okay, and then I may end up taking a thicker black marker to go over it, but I will do the, the eyebrow in a thicker black marker. Oops, bumpy up there. <laughs> okay, and I'm going to take this marker and go around the ear to make that stand out a little more. Okay, and like I said, I think I will do that. Go around the eye. There, maybe one more line across. And that's pretty good. All right, let me go over these eyebrows one more time. And there we have it, our dog, three of them. They are super cute, I love them. Hope you had fun in this video and please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. See you next time.